have the fresh ahi saku block from our fresh teas website and chef andy's going to show how to unpack it and preserve one piece for use next time and then we'll yeah. use one right away so go ahead chef okay, andy okay. cut them first yeah cut this is a 10k crowd back bag that we pack all of our fish in the 10k permeable ba uh, bags are oxygen permeable so what that means is it won't trap any bacteria the oxygen is able to breathe through the package oh, that, and so there's no compliance oh, issues there. Cut already. Yeah so yeah. we have let's see we have four blocks yeah, four. in this one yeah. and there's also a diaper uh, pad inside. The shiny side does belong closer to the fish. It goes through the diaper pad and uh, absorbs moisture to preserve the fish longer. So what yeah. quality is really nice yeah because you can see the, the meat is type and the color is like a uh, you know shiny, a deep, shiny yeah, deep, deep, red. deep red and a shiny night yeah, you can see you can yeah. see the shininess uh, yeah. of it yes so this is a good quality yes good very, quality very nice fish. Quality. yes so chef andy is going to show us how to wrap the ahi so that we can use it next time because this is a lot of ahi to use all at once so we're going to store half of it and use it at a later time okay, okay. go ahead yeah no, first, got to use. No. So we have saran wrap here, yeah. just a piece long enough to roll the, roll the fish a few yeah. times. Just wrap the saran yeah. wrap over the piece. Make sure it's tight, no air inside. Yeah. Yes. Right, perfect. And the fish should, should store in the refrigerator like that, uh, would you say two days, one day, two days, yeah. it should be okay. Yeah, it should be okay. Yeah, with, with an ice pack, uh, 40 hour, 48 hours. With an but, ice pack, but, 48 yeah. hours. And so there's another tri trick to keeping the fish preserved longer. We keep an ice pack directly on the product. So keep the gel packs that come with the fish in the box that you received and make sure to keep those gel packs on the product. Chef Andy's going to show us now how to use the fresh ahi saku and turn it into nigiri. Nigiri. Yes. Yeah. So we have our ahi block and what are you looking yeah. for here? The dig dig ray. We're going to check in the dig going. Yeah. So he's trying to see which way the grain is going in the fish so yeah. that he can cut against against yeah, the grain. Cut, cut, yes. And, and how deep are you going? You just the first one we're gonna yeah just make a make a Ula monkey keep for the okay. Um, so we're saving this from for another application mm -hmm. because the shape of it is kind of yeah, awkward yeah. when you start from a block. So yes. this one can be used for something else later. Yeah. And you're going for that um, angle. Angle. Okay. So we're at about a, a couple. How thick is that? Maybe. Maybe. A couple centimeters or so and you're really angling it down so that the entire way you went parallel to the edge of the yeah, edge of the block middle of a, middle of a longer yeah? yeah and the way you went angle show them the block here yeah. made it really long so i don't know if you can see how he made like it a, really like long a one finger longer yeah yeah so the way that he angled let's see this angle if Chef Andy were to cut straight down here, it would you'd get probably a shape like this, right? Yeah, yes. But because he went angle, yeah, can make you, a you come out longer, with a long, long, piece yeah, long piece and make sure that it's even um, yeah. along the entire slice. Yes. Okay. There you go. So we're making nice, yeah, well, even slices here against the yeah. grain of yeah. the fish yeah. what are you doing here just cut it a little bit because later we're gonna make a nigiri time so it's a little bit more easy oh so you're doing little little cuts like yeah. almost just like scoring scoring the fish yeah. so that it, it folds over the rice better yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Ah, okay. And we have some uh, sushi rice. So this is sushi yeah. rice here. Yeah. How much rice are you grabbing? Uh, well, you did that so yeah. fast. <laughs> That's like uh, maybe two ounces. Just, yeah. uh, just, it's really small. It's like yeah, the size it's of like a finger. Yeah, like, finger. yeah, finger size. Yeah. And what are you doing here? How do you, could I Make try? Could, yeah. <laughs> maybe I want to try with the new one. Okay. Yeah, just, okay. What do you do? You just, <laughs> yeah, okay, you cannot, so you're you cannot too hard. Just, not too yeah, hard, not like too really hard. Yeah, soft. Yeah, but you're, smooth, you know. Just. <laughs> you do, you've probably done this yeah. a million times. You do it so fast. But it, okay, you know, so. it's still, the rice is still easy for. Oh, it separate. still comes apart. So yeah. you're not crushing yeah, it. Not Don't crush it. No crushing, just yeah. really, yeah, really yeah, like just, kind yeah. of roll it yeah. in your. Mine is not moving. Yeah. <laughs> Kind of roll it in your yeah. palm yeah. with they your see, fingers a little later bit. You get it, when you put it, you can. You can shape yeah, it so a little can, more. Yeah, okay. No, is, it, will this pass? It. Yes. This yes. pass. Okay. Yeah. So which side of the fish do you put the rice? Because you scored one side. Yeah, this this clean side, not 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 scored side. Later we oh, can go so into that side, and then because of, you see, this yeah. You can more easy for like I a, see. Okay. to make a the, the kind. You know? Okay, so yeah. the rice goes on the clean side, yeah, not yeah. the cut not, side. Not cut side. Okay. Yeah, not cut side. Yes. So, okay. so I how? Saw we we make it one, one more one more time. Yeah. So this is the clean side. Yeah. You can see the cuts. The cuts are this side, and it goes. It wraps nicely right around the yeah the rice. Yeah, or, 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 or rice, huh? Yeah. Okay. Yes. And you on the home, you can make a simple, similar one like this. Make a, this. Yeah, make a, this rice first and the, put it in the cutting bowl. And the, after, you can just move the, move the, the fish and the, this very really, really home one, it, it very, very similar one. They like this. So you can uh, just, you know, the use your finger, put the this, this. Oh, just shake yeah, it. Yeah, just shake this. Yeah, just like that. Yeah, similar one. Yeah. So you just yeah. push it against. Yeah, push it. Yeah, push not, it. not hot. Not, 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 not crushed, not but crushed. just to form yeah, the, it, yeah, just, uh, the fish around yeah, the rice just a little more. The fish around the, yeah, rice. Oh, okay. Yeah. That way when they eat it, don't yeah. fall apart. Yes. <laughs> You can okay. try sometimes you, you, when you, yeah, you cannot separate, yeah? It's, it's, yeah. It, all right, it's there. Yeah. They're together. Yeah. Some people, when you, you eat in the nigiri, chopstick, and I eat this kind to touch in the uh, That's soil. traditional, yeah, right? Yeah, to do fish the, yeah. first. That's nice so to that touch way, in the soil. It doesn't fall it. apart. You cannot use that side to touch in the soil. Because the then it comes apart. Separate, yes. Ah, separate so yeah. so when you eat this side, this side goes in the show you. Yes. You can yeah. You dip it like this. Yeah. This, yeah. When you use the chopstick, you put it very easy for sep this kind. The fish can hold the rice and the up, and you dip. put it on. Yeah, show you. You can. Ah, you, and it you cannot together. put it this way. Go so you later in the rice, you know, and it, like a little bit wet. It goes, and then it yeah, falls yeah, every. Yeah, from, that happens yes. to me all the time. Was yes. eating it wrong. Yeah, <laughs> eating wrong, right? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Okay. But, uh, but uh, when you you make a uh, rice too tiny, like this kind too very hard, when you, in the mouth. Oh, that, it doesn't yeah, taste that, too that good. That's good. Yeah, like not smooth. You know that you can it be. Too hot. Your yeah. teeth is yeah, busy yeah, yeah, breaking busy. down yes, the rice. Yes. Okay, it got busy, it. Busy, yes. Okay, I'll show you one more piece. Thank you. Tiny scores yeah. on one side. Does it matter what side they score the fish? Any yeah, side? That, Does that it matter? matter which side, yes. Score on one side. Like you have rice. your rice ball. Squeeze. Like turn away. Yeah. That's, yeah. And if you want to be real traditional, some 
sushi sushi chef used wasabi underneath the fish and the rice. Yes. That's um uh, the, the original traditional the, the, yeah, style. Style, yeah. But here in America, you just yeah, leave American on the side. American people like on the side, you can depend on how how much wasabi to use. That way, yeah, does it burn? Yeah, does it burn, give you yeah. that kick? Yeah, and that give you special <laughs> surprise. <laughs> special. <laughs> So at home, if we don't have a special dish, just any flat dish will be presentable for yeah. the nigiri, yeah? Yes. Now we're ready to try our ahi nigiri. And Chef Andy told us that it's actually tradition to dip the fish part first into the ahi wasabi or the shoyu wasabi. So we're going to grab, see, grabbing, turn it over. Hold it like this in your chopsticks. And we have shoyu, shoyu wasabi, wasabi yes. here. Fish goes in first, then one bite. One, one. <laughs> Fish is so fresh. Rice is perfect. Everything's good. You gotta try this one. The ahi is so fresh, tastes so yummy. Thank you. Thank you, Chef. You're